Shall we start? Let the games begin. Hi YouTube! So here I am again, Mariana. So today I'm gonna present something new in my channel that's a new series that I'm going to start doing and it's called the Techno Series. Um, this series is about a editing it's about editing, lighting, filming, thumbnails, um, video inspiration, everything like that and how I do it. So yeah, we're gonna have a lot of fun in this, this series and it's for the people who do YouTube videos or want to start doing them. This episode is gonna be about thumbnails. I'm gonna show you how I edit my thumbnails, which program I use, uh, the measurements, everything like that. and. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this series and if you do give it a thumbs up so I know that you guys want me to do more. I'm gonna be uploading this kind of videos, videos, uh, once a month or maybe more if you guys like it a lot. Give me suggestions in the comments down below telling me what you would like to see in the next episode of this series. Also, if you have any suggestions for the name of the series then just leave them down below oh and I'm gonna wear my glasses throughout this video because you know it's a techno series let's go right on to how I do my thumbnails so just do a thumbnail the first thing you need it's a picture of what your video is about or what you want to be what you want your thumbnail to be you can also make like a clash what I do is um, during the video I just take screenshots of that part or that image that I want my thumbnail to be like right now I'm gonna do my thumbnail so you make different poses or anything you want your thumbnail to be and then you just take a screenshot when you're editing so the program I use for editing my thumbnails is called PeakMonkey and it's totally free but you can also get the premium version. What you have to do is go to edit and then you're gonna go to computer and select the picture you're gonna edit for your thumbnail. The first way I'm gonna show you how to edit your thumbnail is using a picture that you already have and then I'm gonna show you how to do a collage. The first thing you're gonna do is crop your picture to 1280 and to 720. Now you're gonna go to words and you can put whatever word you want and you can go to like the different fonts uh, there is. As you can see there are some fonts that have like a little crown and that means that only uh, users with a premium program can use them. So you can make your words bigger or you can change the color of them, add more things, whatever you want to do with your phrase or your words. What I normally do is add the title of my video to the thumbnail. Now I'm going to go to overlays that it's a little butterfly at the left and I'm going to add a heart but you can add different uh, shapes like flowers, geometric shapes. Um, yeah, you can choose the color of your overlay, overlay, <laughs> and yeah, that's really cool. So you can move it around, uh, change the shape, and you can even send it to the back, so it's like in the background of your word. And you can also pick your own overlays, and that is going to help us for doing the collage. And what I'm gonna do is pick two overlays, overlays, I mean thumbnails that I already did. So they're like um, right there and it's like showing what you can do. And yeah, you can choose pictures or you can also pick overlays that you download or from Google. When 
you're finished uh, doing your thumbnail, you're just gonna save it, and I recommend saving it as Xian Xian. <laughs> That's um the best quality for your thumbnail. And then you're just gonna put the name of your thumbnail, and you're just gonna go to save to my computer. Now I'm going to show you how to um, make a collage thumbnail in PicMonkey. You're going to open your picture, but this time it's going to be a white background. Um, we're gonna, the first thing you have to do is crop it as the last time, and you're going to put the same measurements because that's the, import, the most important thing in a thumbnail for it to look good. And now we're going to take our own the overlays and they're gonna be the pictures that you want your collage to have so you're gonna take all the pictures you want to have and yeah continue doing that now you're going to put them in the order you want them to be like if you want this picture to be here the other picture to be there however you want your collage to be Once you're done doing uh, the, um, like organizing your uh, collage, you're gonna take a geometrical um, overlay and we're gonna take, well, I take the rectangle, you can take whatever you want, I recommend this one. And then you're gonna put it to, um, uh, between your, your images so you have a line that divides them and they're not like all irregular. So you can actually change the color if you want your lines to be um, orange or you want your lines to be black I normally put them white but you can put them however you want so yeah we're just gonna continue uh, doing this process and putting a line between each of our pictures you can add whatever you want like uh, words or like uh, the title of your video I put outfit of the day because it's, um, like the theme of this collage when you're done you're just gonna save it the same way we saved the other thumbnails uh, for putting a thumbnail in a video of yours you're gonna go to video manager and now we're, you're gonna uh, uh, Put edit the video you want to change your thumbnail and then you're just gonna see the options of thumbnails that you can put and underneath those three options there's gonna be a button that says uh, custom thumbnail you're gonna click it and then there's gonna be all the you're gonna select the file of your thumbnail and yeah that's gonna be how you do a custom thumbnail in your YouTube so you're just gonna put um, save changes so yeah guys that's how I do my thumbnails so <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video and um, if you found it helpful and if you did give it a thumbs up so I know you guys like this series okay so yeah if you like uh, this kind of videos then subscribe to my channel so you know when um, they come out and yeah Okay, so I'll talk to you next Tuesday or Friday. Bye! Hello there. Let's start over. You know, down here, up here, I don't know. Awkward. Onto the. A clutch. What to do? I'm waking up